How's it going everybody? Welcome to We Do Tech. Now today's video I'm really excited about because it's pretty much the first time ever that I've actually owned a product like this. I have owned one other product similar but not one exactly like this. So the product that I'm talking about, you guys saw in the name, it is my first official gaming laptop and that is the Predator Triton 500 from Acer. Now, beforehand, now I have owned a laptop before, not a gaming laptop, but a while back my mother fell and she needed a new laptop because she accidentally broke hers. So I gave her mine, which wasn't a big deal because it's also just like a, a third generation i3 laptop. So I couldn't even edit videos on the thing. Didn't really bother me that much. So this is officially my first high-end laptop and I'm super excited about this because this thing is a beast and yeah I'm, I'm really excited um so let's quickly check it out so firstly a big shout out to Acer South Africa for sending this one over uh, I'm gonna work with them a lot more in the future and this is just the first one we're gonna check out so let's quickly open it up hopefully the camera up there can spot everything and yeah let's check it out now uh, so firstly let me quickly just get my knife mosquito never mind all right so got me knife let's just cut it open the knife out of reach there uh, i'm still not the best at un unboxings but here we go. Let's do it like this. Hopefully you guys can see that. Do, 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 do. Boom. Yeah. Is there anything else inside? Uh, yeah, just a power brick, which we'll just leave there. So first we have, and that one to the side. First we have just a little, Leaflet from Acer, we have our manual and then also setup guide. Don't really think I need that. I'm, I know something about laptops and PCs, okay? I think I'm all right. And then we have this. Oh, that looks awesome. That looks cool. Take this off, all of the packaging. And then, where, how do I open it? How do I open it? All right, so first I need to cut these. There we go, and boom, bah. Awesomeness, I have to say, that looks pretty cool. I'm just gonna keep that, because it looks nice. Packaging, always, nice packaging is always awesome. All right, and lifting it out. I think we're gonna need that for now. Oh, okay, over here. There we go it's a small like portable laptop which is awesome for me because again i don't have a laptop so i didn't want to go for something massive i know they have like their massive ones uh, but i want to be able to actually travel and have a laptop that'll be able to edit my videos on and this is perfect for that it's like one centimeter thick uh, it does have a nice cooling on the, the sides. At the bottom, I do like the blue from Acer and Predator. That's nice. Now let's quickly flip it open and see how it looks inside. And there we go. So firstly, this laptop is running a full HD display with G-Sync at 144 hertz, so perfect for gaming. And to maybe some of you guys are surprised, this is my first monitor that I own, which is a gaming monitor with a high refresh rate like this. I don't really have like a lot of gaming, like high refresh rate stuff. So this is really cool. Looking forward to checking that out. Let's quickly turn it on. Hopefully it has power. No, no power. Okay, power connected. Let's see if it turns on. There we go, awesome. All right, so let's quick go over the specs for this beast because this is actually a beast of a laptop. 
Nice speakers, good surround, like that. Uh, okay, specs wise. So this thing does have an IS7 9750H six core 12 thread CPU. I think it base clock at around 2.5 gigahertz. Don't quote me on this. I think 2.5 gigahertz and it boosts up to about four, 4.5, uh, depending on the cores, of course, the temps and so on. And then it does have 16 gigs of RAM. Uh... Hi there, I'm Cortana and I'm here to help. Hi Cortana. A little sign in here, a touch of Wi-Fi there and we'll have your PC ready for all you plan to do. Okay. Use your voice or the keyboard. No, I don't like you, go away. Okay, so uh, it has 16 gigs of memory. It has a 512 gig NVMe SSD. Oh. And then the cherry on a top. This thing is running an RTX 2080. So pretty much the second strongest GPU and I think the strongest notebook GPU is in this system. And Oh, I'm so excited. So if you guys also know, this is pretty much GPU wise stronger than both my systems over there. My edit system and my gaming system be a low. Ah, oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Finally, I can play games at super high refresh rates. But anyway, that is pretty much it for the unboxing. Now let's take it for a test run and play some games on this thing. Because yeah, this is gonna be awesome. So now everything has been set up. I've actually been using this laptop for like two or three days now. Uh, every, I've edited videos on the thing, but I haven't actually gamed on it. Now, Call of Duty Modern Warfare has just been released. So I'm looking forward to playing some of it on this system. 144 Hertz at RTX 2080. Super excited to trying it out. So yeah, let's get into some multiplayer. Now currently, all of my settings is on pretty much a max 144 hertz again g-sync is enabled pretty much everything and now we're going to enable turbo mode which is going to ramp up the fans quite a lot but of course because the laptop is so thin that's always the drawback if you do have a system like this the noise is going to be the only downfall really <laughs> Alrighty, so we're in game and the auto is super loud. So I'm currently recording as well on the system with uh, shadow play. So let's. Right, so we're getting well, like 130 frames a second, uh, 150, and again everything is set on max. I haven't. First need to get my bearings. I have no idea where I am. I haven't played on this map before. And I'm dead. Alright, awesome. Okay, so jumping into another game, the previous game was just awful. I hate the map we played on. But this is the first time playing on this one and apparently I'm also not too sure about it. Saw so some shroud playing on it. I didn't look the funnest. Drop down the frames a bit here, it's around 80, the mid 80s, but still ray tracing on, I think this is where ray tracing gets in with all of the lights, but still. Oh, sniper over there. Double kill.
Let's see if I can get anything. Nothing. Jeez. Oh! Boom! That's it! Nice! And top of the leaderboard, son! So that's pretty much it for my first experience with the new Predator Triton 500. I would say I'm really looking forward because again, this thing is pretty much kind of stronger than that one. GPU wise, memory, not so much. CPU, kinda, it does have an 1800X, so not entirely, but it's really, really close. And again, I've edited some videos on this thing, and it's definitely faster than my main system because of that RTX 2080. And then also because it does have the quick sync for Premiere, which is nice. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to playing more on this. I am going to stream some more Call of Duty, or I'm gonna stream Call of Duty. So super super excited uh but anyway that's just it for the unboxing the review will be coming out a bit later want to spend some time with this uh, baby put it through its paces and do a proper review for you guys but anyway that's pretty much it a big thanks to acer and Predator south africa for sending the laptop over uh and if you guys want to get it for yourself i will leave a link in the video description but anyway yeah nice time for you guys so yeah it's like 2 a.m. now, <laughs> so I'm gonna hit the hay now. <laughs> but thanks for watching, and I will check all of you next time. Cheers, guys.